Hello everyone! Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VIII! I'm the Black Shadow and I know I said I'd off screen come out of uh, Delling City but uh, I'm not going to actually because I've, I've noticed a few things as I was just walking around. First of all, this guy here, I didn't actually talk to him on the way in. As he says here, this General Carraway was dismissed of his duties after the Solstice rose to power. Yeah, that folks, there's rumours flying that he was involved in the assassination plan, but they haven't proved it yet, so that's. That should uh, keep. Ow! Run over me, why don't you? Uh, they think they might have got him. But yeah, folks, I want to just show this off quickly. I've, instead of walking all the way out the city, if you just go up from Carraway's mansion, it takes you right to this screen, which leads to the exit. <laughs> Rather than running around the entire place, so uh, there we go. So in the last video, folks, um, we successfully got out of the D District Prison, and our our teams have split up into two. We've got Squall, Zell, and uh, Renoa are going off to Balam Garden on a uh, hijacked Garbadian train. Try and warn them there's a missile strike coming, you know, and everything else. Try and make sure they're okay. While Selfie, Irvine, and Keistus are actually going to go to the Galbadian missile base. To stop the missiles even be sent off in the first place. So cool. Yeah, you know, this should be quite good. Um, just so you know, I have actually done a little bit of changes off-screen, folks. Um, uh, to do with Selfie and Irvine, I've actually switched around some of their guardian forces here. I'll just quickly show. What I mean, um, I've given Irvine. Um, has Irvine has now got hold of um, uh, of. Uh, what does she have? I forgot what I've done now. <laughs> Um, I let, um, I think, yeah, I switched, um, Ketsukotl, which, um, uh, Selfie did have, Irvine's now got, and instead I've given her, um, Siren, and the reason for that is because, um, Siren, um, got the magic plus 40%, which I really wanted Selfie to get. Only cost of that is that, you can see, she doesn't have a HP junction at this point, which does kind of suck a bit, but hey, I don't mind, I think that's quite, that's worth it in my books. Um, so yeah, so that's, that's just what the junctions are. Look, Irvine, 98 strength, Selfie, 106 magic, and Keys is a really nice all-rounder. So, you know, she's going to be pretty, no, all grown pretty handy. So, pretty good. Um, and the only other thing I'm just going to quickly do while I'm thinking about it, ammo refinement. Um, which one is it? So, yeah, seeing these refined to the various ammos, we need to get hold of some stuff. Um, we need, I want to try and get hold of some armor-piercing ammo for um, this next match. I can't remember. I, I, I'm trying to think. Uh, can we get it from some cards? Uh, the tri-face, yeah. Tri no, it's the tri-face. No, we need some sharp spikes. What gives us sharp spikes? I honestly forget. Ah, Grand Madness is doing. There we go. So we've got... Oh, I keep doing that. So if we get hold of um, ten sharp spikes, we can now put on the ammo refinement. And we can get ourselves a hundred armor piercing ammo, which is really nice armor piercing ammo. Um, basically, it completely and utterly ignores an enemy's defense or vitality. Um, is the official way of looking at it in this game. Um, so it's you know it's armor piercing, which is pretty damn nice, folks. So um, we're gonna go ahead and uh, we're probably gonna make some use of that in um, this net in this video, folks, which I've been looking forward to doing for a while. Must be said, this is. Probably one of my favourite parts of the game, if not the favourite part. This is so, so much fun. Um, and the missile base actually isn't very far from Delling City. If you just uh, follow the road down, in fact, you don't need to follow the road, but I am. Because I'm a respectable driver. And there's the missile base right here. Now I'm hoping Selfie's plan of, you know, being in a gabbarded vehicle means we're going to get inside. Oh god, they're gonna find us out! They bought it? Wow! Can't can they leak? Can they even see us? I'm not complaining. Following the launch radio garden, prepare for the launch in Balam. What the hell is that? So itchy and smelly, they found some spare uniforms. Very useful. I can't believe it's a selfie. It Look at that, you just see the height difference gradually. Doesn't matter. We have to put a stop we have to stop the missiles. Yeah. Doesn't really matter when they launch, we just gotta stop before that. 
If there's a door, we go in. If there's anything we can break, we break. And in the end, we blow this place to smithereens. Sounds like a plan to me. But this is... This is so much fun, this place, folks. I love it a bit. And it's also quite interesting, actually, because there's actual couple ways um, that you can go about this, um, which uh, I believe Legacy actually did mention. Um, actually, I'm just going to go ahead and quickly save the game, because I've just changed things around a little bit. Love the music as well. This place is just... I, I'm, I love everything about it. It's so much fun. Alright, so... So, the Galbadian Missile Base. Now, this is a interesting area because um, this is the, the next, the, no, the first area since the delay, um, not the delay, the Timber Mission, um, where you can actually go ahead and gain yourself some seed levels, um, up to two seed levels, which is pretty nice. That's, a, that's an extra grand, you know, at every payday. That's pretty good. Uh, admittedly, our money's reasonably high at this point, but we'll ignore that. So, um, so, so how does this place work, folks? Now, there is two ways you can go about the Gabad Missile Base. Now, you can, if you so desire, wage a war, fight everything, no, literally take on the entire missile base, which we could do, but I figure, you know what, you've seen me fighting plenty of times, I'm sure you get the general gist, and considering that we were a little overpowered, it might not make the most interesting viewing, there'll be lots of cutting, and... To be honest, it's so much work for even myself editing out all the repeat fights, I can't be asked. So we're going to do this solid, uh, Metal Gear Solid style, sort of, and we're actually going to infiltrate the base, folks, um, and, you know, with our disguises. Um, now, as I said, there's two whole seed ranks on offer in this place. Um, the way the maths apparently is done is um, that, uh, well, if we, um, we sort of start off with the whole 200 points, but the various actions that we take will actually, um, no, reduce uh, the amount of points we can have. But so, you know, if we do everything correctly, we will get two seed ranks. We could lose some points here and there if we're not careful. But I'll let you know how to get the whole 200. Now you see, both these doors are locked. There's a inside the center here. There's a little, uh, little machine here. An ID card, but we don't have one. Calm down, dear. Found that in the car. It's better work, otherwise we're gonna have some problems. Nice! That works very nice. Alright, let's get a move on. And by the way, folks, that door on the right, uh yeah, you see there's another little machine there is another machine here. Unauthorized card access denied. We can't open that door just yet, folks. So bear that in mind. Uh oh, it's guards. I don't think sneaking by is gonna work really. If we, if we just act, no, if we just walk by quietly. Yeah, if we want, let's just, just walk by here. You know, that's probably the best thing to do. Just play it nice, play it nice and uh, nice and easy. Uh oh. <laughs> that suspicious? Walking in a single file. Your parents must have raised you for. <laughs> what? Always oh, thank your parents for bringing you up. <laughs> what is this? Yes, sir. Well, that was weird. <laughs> that was very weird. <laughs> oh, dear me. I think we should just slowly back away. Back away. Just carry on with our lives. Oh dear. You just see that down there, folks? Those are the missiles. I tell you what, they look pretty, pretty. They look, they, they look like the business. Let's have a look around here. Oh, the missile launched through this door. All right, let's head in there and try and stop them. You know, what we're here for to stop the missiles. Maybe we can, if we stop the missile launchers, then they can't do anything. Lost should be arriving here soon. Uh, so they're obviously still getting in position. Hidden draw point here. Full life spells. The same one that Selfie had from uh, uh, Limit Break. Very nice. Uh, only five. That's kind of disappointing. Do an inspection. 
Alright, we'll leave you to it. Place is off limits. Damn. Although, if you look here, there is a little machine just hiding here, folks. So look at this. The Galbanian Republic Army Department. Damn, we can't get in. Never mind. Oh, we just need to go ahead and find the password. It don't touch that. Uh, I tell you what, if this guy's standing here, we'd be the past, we wouldn't be able to do anything with it. Now, I'm wondering, folks, have you seen it yet? Have you seen what we, where we need to go yet, next yet? Because I always thought it was very craftily hidden, but there is actually a little passage down the back here. Really, really nastily hidden, that. Really crafty. Another draw point here, this is uh, a normal one. Blind spells. Eh, we'll give him keys. This why not? Yeah, only nine. That's all right. What are they doing? Are they going fishing? Oh yeah, we can't speak to the guy. We have to speak to this one. What do you want? Circuit room. Hmm. Sounds interesting. Sounds very important. I suppose, if you insist. Tell the guys by the missile launcher to go on ahead and that will catch up with them later. Now, we do actually need to set, uh, relay this message, right? We do actually need to do this. Bear in mind, uh, you do actually want to, uh, give the right answer. I'll, I'll show you what I mean here, folks. Oh, not this guy. I want to speak to the guy up here. Yeah, but this guy is doing the inspections. Yeah, got a message for you. What is it? Now, you want to say that they, that they were to go on ahead. If you choose it, they'll go on ahead. You actually lose seven seed points for that. So just bear that in mind. Bands to the circuit room. Mate, this team said they were too busy, so that you that you should go on ahead. Uh, he's still busy though as well. He told them I can't go yet. Well, what are we messengers? I mean, we're here trying to no, we're here to try and stop the missile launch. We can't keep going backwards and forwards, giving messages around. It's not our job. We don't work here though, actually, for that matter. So I suppose we can't really can't really buy that money. Yeah, they said they were too busy. You know, thank, thank you for saying something. I don't know. Your choice but to go. I don't want to go, do they? Can we go to the circuit room? That's an invitation! That's not cool! It'll be fine. Relax. I hope you're right. That's it. We're counting on you. All right. Woohoo! Blow the place to smithereens. <laughs> well, that's pretty cool, that folks. So we, oh, we get to go to the circuit room. We'll see what we can do in there. All right. Well, the circuit room was back up here, folks. So that guard, that very strange guard, was for that matter. We have a chat with this guy. The main news team asks us to take their place at the inspection. Look, well, call him my relief. Go ahead, inspection. All right. That was quite easy. Well, let's see what we can do in here. Ooh. Look at this, folks. Looks very important. That's that must be the actual circuit breaker. Or 
or something. Certainly generating power. And massive load of consoles and machines. Let's see what we can't do. Uh, dunno. Well, well, we're not interested in making it run. We just want to break it. Let's just whack it. I just press whatever. Look at her go. Nothing happened. Weird. Just press whatever. Ah, that worked. Whoa, it's going dark. Electrical system malfunction. Maintenance team investigate immediately. Yeah, we, we better get out of here. Keesus is quite right. Next! Right, let's get out of here, folks. Seems we're on emergency lighting. If we find us in here, we're in big trouble. Uh-oh. Did they just... Now, you from this point, you can now go to war with the base. However, if you decide to do that, you will lose an entire seed rank. So let's see if we can't try and uh, no get up, find ourselves a way out of this. Yeah, we're just about to go to go call on you. All right then, let us take care of it. All right. Uh. Whoa! Damn it! <laughs> what the hell? Did you just whack them upside the head? <laughs> what? Something a little out of control. That's a generous way of putting it out it. What, what the hell did we do to these guys? We don't even know they've just vanished! We just beat the we just beat him up. That works. Oh yeah, look at that, folks. Look at the missiles down there. Everything stopped. I should buy us some. I should definitely buy us some time. But that doesn't stop the missile launch. We've still got to stop it somehow. Thing is, if we turn off the power, that might be hard to do. Power's down. We need some help. Ah, look at that, folks. The guard's gone. Very nice. Well, that, well, we can go right past them now. That's good. All right, let's get out of here. And... Uh oh, what to do? What to do? No, come on now. Let's, let's we just play it cool. You know, just play the play the game. Need some help in here. Uh, what? Help him out. Well, if we, we run away, that's going to look pretty damn suspicious. I think we better help them, folks. Just to try and uh, buy some time. What the heck are the maintenance guys doing? Do you want to know the answer? It's called Jackal. Because they're, uh, you know, they're, they're in the dream world at the moment. They're, they're counting the stars. Man, that is pretty damn big. Jesus. Hey, look at them there. You can see there's a couple guys there. They are they are not moving that at all. Alright, so one in the centre, two on each side. I suppose we've got to go help them out. This is kind of ironic, but... we we got, we got to help push the, the missile launchers they're going to use against Balan? This is all hopefully ironic. Um, I love the guy, the the the, the guy they just like going say no, keep going. You're all right. You're all right. You're all right. <laughs> oh dear. Come on, this is doing my arm in. 
I didn't expect this from a Final Fantasy game. Come on! Nearly there. Ah, oh, there we go. That's the heck. Christ. Well, that's pretty good. <laughs> Look at him there, uh, holding their arms. Good work. What you need to confirm the coordinates in the control panel. Ah, that's pretty good. No, we are talking. You're damn right, self. Ooh, selfie. Apologies for that, folks. I do apologise. Um, and yes, folks, that was this little thing here. Just so you know. It's like, it's just busted up. Yeah, let's just destroy the control panel, but... Hold on. Uh, wait, that, is that a good idea? It'll be a mega bummer if we launch the missiles by mistake. Just hold back a little and just mess around with it. My god, Selfie's showing some self-restraint! Some composure! Who'd have thunk it? Alright. The Hyper Technology mis Missile System, or the HTMS. Man, look at this, folks. There's a few things here that you can actually do here, folks. Uh, let's actually have a look at uh, have a look at the equipment here. As you see, what else they were uh, now? What else we're dealing with here? See, so we've got the this is the missile launch. You see, we just pushed that, folks. That's got four rocket pods on it. Gosh. Uh, can I? There is something else there, but for some reason the D-pad always never works that properly. Hold on a second. It used to work earlier. Uh, it, it just seems really fiddly. Can I... How do you change this? There we go. Left, that's the one. That's the missile. There's a quarter input device. Not really advanced technology. If you set the error ratio on maximum, Pretty sure the missiles will miss. Hmm. That might be something to uh, investigate. Can I get out of here, folks? Game. Game, can I leave? Game, come on, let me go. Thank you. Stop playing silly buggers. So, let's have a look at the. Um, the uh, we'll go to the target here first, actually. So this is actually to do with the actual, uh, you know, the whole set of thing. So can we change the target? No, we can't, we can't change the target. So the missiles are going to have to go to Badam. If they got sent there, we can't change it. Damn. But if we go to this, folks, the error ratio. Now here you can set the actual error ratio, folks. Um, now, this seems a bizarre concept. Now... Just logically thinking, folks. Why the hell would you have this? Why would you have this? The point of sending a missile is that it's supposed to actually, you know, hit what you're aiming for. Why have an error ratio meter? Seems bizarre. But we need to upload all this information, folks. It's all, you know, it's all done mechanically and all that sort of thing. So we want to actually um, upload it to the free missile pods here. So that, that well actually, you know, that error ratio goes in. Sorry, folks. It's quite warm in here. Alright, so that's all that uploaded. So we've... Cool, so we've actually set the error ratio, so at least if the missiles are going to go, hopefully they're going to miss. What's the simulation here? Right, so this is what we're supposed to happen. So there's the missile base on the left, and there's the missile going along to, uh, to Balam there. Uh, 
this is actual, this is ba the, the Balam continent here. Here's the missile. Yeah, look at that, folks. Now, beforehand, that is a direct line straight into Balam Garden. 95% success rate. But look at it now, folks. An accuracy rate of 20 to 30%. An error ratio of 65 to 80. So, you know, with, with any luck, you know, that's a... I think it's a let's say, folks, that's a 25% chance that'll hit. Problem with that, folks, is that you can see that the missile's still going to land pretty damn close to Balan. In fact, he's still got the town just next to it, so, you know. And even so, that's a 25% chance that it'll hit if the missiles are launched. There must be, well, isn't there not perhaps a way we can actually stop missiles being set in the first place? Because then it's a 100% chance they'll miss, surely. Uh, this might require a bit of um, investigation, folks. We're not allowed up here. We've come to report the missile coordinate data. Very well, go right ahead. Oh, thanks. We have someone that beauty in our base. Uh, stop with the music, folks. All systems go. We got no power. What are you talking about? Uh oh, we have the final launch phase. That's bad. This is the control room. We're now entering the final phase of the missile launch. We still gotta stop the missiles! What are you doing in here? Brought on the missile coordinates. What? Have we just been rumbled? Did you just give the seed salute? Selfie! It's about time we rumbled. What are you doing? Whoa! Ta da! <laughs> Midge uniform is itchy and it stinks. <laughs> but it's boss time! And yet, we were obviously going to have a fight somewhere. I mean, come on! a strange sort of boss fight, but never mind. Time for us to get serious. Shoot him in the face! Bang! <laughs> These guys actually aren't all that bad, I, I, I'll let you know. If we just scan the base, they're not that bad. Ow! Ow! Drums! What's the other guy got? So they've got a few spells, they've got a lot of state element spells. Gavin in missile base leader. Strong the red or gale bandits on the thousand health, that's not too bad. He's weak against poison like all most human type enemies. Let's just hit him, please. I should tell why actually. I'm kinda curious now, ow. No wonder we couldn't get this to work, could we? Ah, oh, never mind. It's worth a try, I think. <laughs> Just the pure curiosity of it. Uh, we better get some curing going on, actually. We get, uh, we get um, some curing going. Um, use, uh, we'll use, uh, not my mind, we'll use fight. No, Blizzard are right against the base soldiers, pretty best. Are they from Garden? Oh, I think he's seen the magic. He's not dead? Oh, there we go. Now, I would get Irvine a hit, but I want to get some healing going on, so if we use, uh, we get Cure against Irvine. Uh, as you tell, we'll draw, draw a couple of reflects now. They might be, they'll be quite handy later on in the game. Look at that 2,500 health! That is good. Ow. That actually hurts a lot. A lot more than I would like. 
Oh, I'll borrow some reflex spells, thank you. Now he's all dead. Hit him in the face! <laughs> Just collapses. No, uh, it's, it's a weird type of a uh, boss fight that. What the hell, experience? That's not a proper boss fight. Boss fight, you don't even get experience. Ooh, shit, we deserve doom, that's pretty good. <coughs> Sorry. We still gotta stop these missiles at uh oh. Alarms are going as well. Stop the missiles, blow the beast of smithereens, and get out of here! Alright, well, let's uh, yeah, just split up and start looking, folks. And before I'm just quickly thinking about it, uh, let's just quickly fiddle on with Shiva. She's, as I said, learned the Doom command, but she's actually a pretty useful command, that so can be. I'll demonstrate later on, but I want a second level of defense junction next, we'll get that. And actually, you know what I'm going to do, folks, when I press the right button? God, I'm curious to think here, just, oh, God, I might put one or two on here. But for no particular reason. Yeah, why the hell not? Got an Irvine here. We'll just, uh. Yeah. Oh, crap. I've got to put on extra magic. Whoops! Yeah, Mad Rush Command. Yeah, I'm going to show you this out. That's what Act Mad Rush does. Can't use it. Cast Haste, Berserk, and Protect on all party members. So, you know, it's basically all out assault. Which is pretty good if you've got a lot of strong physical attackers against certain weak defense, but. You know, against stuff like powerful bosses, it's a very dangerous command, actually. You know, it's, it's sort of all or nothing. So you just gotta be careful with that. Um, anyone think we can jump to? No, 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 fine. Alright, let's run this uh, this um, self destruct command thing, then. I know this isn't Resident Evil. But that doesn't mean we can't have some self destruct mechanisms. Why not? Alright, good work, Irvine. Oh, well done, Irv. I put my hopes up. Great job. Uh, stop, stop following me around. Ah, that's the one. Nice. I've just got to stop the missiles now. Yeah, stop the missiles. Oh, we need. Oh, crap. That's uh, sort of uh, blowing the game a little bit. <laughs> Whoopsie daisies, I've completely gone ahead of myself. Yeah, we need to find a self-destruct mechanism for the base. Blow it to hell so they can't even... No, we've got the missiles stopped. So we just got to find a self-destruct mechanism now. Ooh, very nice. Oh, well, leads us back here, folks. Cool. Just going to save the game. Why not? You know, saving is for winners. Right, let's head back in here then, folks. Oh, damn, please. Did I just... I just locked myself out? I just locked myself out. Oh my god, I can't believe I just did that. Oh, I'm gonna have to walk all the way around. Oh, Black Shadow, you numpty. You numpty. Just locked myself out of the control room. Oh, I can't believe I just did that. <laughs> Learn from my, me, folks. Don't do that. Okay, here we are back in the control room like nothing ever happened. The, the last 30 seconds, just ignore it ever happened. Right, let's try and find this self-destruct sequence. Yeah, I, I did go completely ahead of myself there, but we're trying to stop the missiles. I just blurted the self-destruct mechanism. Silly man. Oh, is that it? 
set time. Yeah, a bit like uh, back in the fire cavern, in which we have to set a time between 10 and 40 minutes. However, you know, this, and then also like the fire cavern, um, this uh, will actually affect the amount of C points you get at the end of this, believe it or not. However, the, it's a little bit different. Now, in the fire cavern, you'll remember that um, the points we got was based on the time we had left at the end. <coughs> this is different. This. In this, uh, the missile base, the points are determined by the time you set off in set in the first place. So if we set um, 10 minutes, we get like the full reward. If you set 40 minutes, you lose 75 points. That's like nearly a whole seed level for that. But you don't need to. Just set 10 minutes anyways. And besides, um, the good thing as well um, is that it is kind of hard if you set 10 minutes and go to just fight everything on, on the way out. But, um, there is a shortcut door in the detonation room that will, uh, will actually, it's supposed to only open once the self-struct timer is less than 20 minutes, the door we just went through. I think it like, it must like lock if you set 30 or 40, you've got to walk around, but if we just set 10 minutes, or 20 for that matter, we'll be fine. But you don't need that much time anyways. 10 minutes until detonation. Oh, staff evacuate the base immediately. All, all employees, please proceed to the bottom platform. Let's get the hell out of here, folks. And we'll just get in here. I can't believe I locked myself out. That was embarrassing. Uh, what the hell? Aren't you dead? Did you become a zombie? We haven't even got the zombie status magic yet. What the hell? What is he doing? This doesn't bode. This does not look good. Not over yet. I think he. Ah, oh, I think he's dead now. What do you mean by it's not over yet? And you notice? Whoa! What the hell was that? I want it open. Come on. Yeah. See, it's locked again. Yeah, you notice, folks, the um, save point's actually missing there. That's why I went... I, I, well, I, I'm attempting to say it's why I went in save first, but it wasn't. And G-Army are getting the hell out of here. Hey, is that my... Is that our car? <laughs> He's kind of just running and booking it. Getting the hell out of here is probably a good idea. <laughs> getting out, folks. Well, we got to get out. Well, we need to get out of here first as well, folks. Game. What? Oh Jesus! Oh my God! I thought we stopped them. Oh God! The guy just set the missiles off again. Crap! Oh. That is bad. I, I thought we stopped it, folks. Can't we just, can't we all just get along? You don't want to suffer her wrath. Excuse me. I whipped her backside. I think you should be a bit more worried about me. But believe it or not, folks. It is boss time once again, and this is proper boss time. Against... Well, I would say what it is, but I don't remember. It's a, it's a mess. Shoot it in the face! Against the BGH251F2. Ooh, it's a new spell. Very nice. I'll grab hold of that, whatever that is. Let's have a look at this guy. He's a proper boss here. 8,000 health, but look at the stats. Very impressive. The Ironclad. The main cannon is more powerful than uh, ATM's Raybot. We get Thunder, Earth, and Water. It's pretty handy. We've got hard oh, because we've got some Thundara spells. That's pretty good. We do this weekend's earth on a polypot of the brothers. Ow! Bloody hell! That did some damage! Good grief! 
you got to be careful of this guy. He really does hurt. That chain gun? My god, that is powerful. Smite them, selfie! That wasn't too bad. That was pretty decent. Ow! Stop shooting me! That bloody hurts! Actually, we tell you, we better heal up. Um, uh, we should heal up Selfie here. Might be an idea. Whoa! Things blowing up. Catwoman. It's only one. Don't worry. Yeah, let's get Selfie healed a little bit. There, I did not have health that long. Uh, I tell you, actually, we might probably best off cast cast perhaps a protect spell too. That might be an idea. That chain gun really does hurt. But it's probably a good decision, especially selfie. Uh, we got Fondares, all you do is well. Yeah, there goes another one. These bloody like reactors. And a third! Let's just get out of here! Can't let him seize his MRV! You're not gonna have an MRV by the end of this! No, draw, protect! Bloody hell! Well, actually, this is a good time actually to um, showcase, uh, well, let's show off um, Irvine's um, uh, special attack actually, his limit break. Which is actually pretty cool for that matter, folks. The shot command. Now, all these ammos we've been getting over the course of the game so far. The great thing about Irvine's limit break, it's been like Kesis is there's actually various types of um, attacks you can do. So you've got like your standard ammo, you've got like shotgun ammo, which um, uh, yeah, attacks all opponents, fast ammo, which is rapid fire, armor piercing ammo, which which ignores defense, and the pulse ammo, which is really like the best ammo in the game. Let's use the armor piercing ammo. This is why I actually um, got it equipped. The armor shot. Press R1 as much as you can. Whoa! Look at the damage! Holy crap! He's actually dead. When it starts going zero, they're actually dead. Bloody hell, that was 4,000 a shot. That was powerful. Because it just because it ignores defense, so it just. And because Irvine's got like 100 strength. Hey, victory is ours. The place is a mess. Alrighty then, victory is ours. We've got three minutes to get the hell out of here. Okay. <laughs> no, this one's still going on, folks. What now, Captain? It needs repairs, sir. Oh, I like the G army sometimes. But yeah, this is still going on, folks. We're not finished yet. Ow. Well, I say ow, but we've got protect on, so we're pretty okay now. Oh, look, that didn't look too pleasant. Ooh. So, well, let's just cast on him. Draw the fire! Set his ass back on fire again. That these guys are pretty, pretty easy. <laughs> All right, we won. Nice. Two minutes to spare. That's a bit close. No one light. Weapons monthly June. Pretty cool. Uh, two potions. Pretty nice. Twenty-four ability points. Lovely. The brothers learned defend. Cool. Alright folks, well, uh, that's it, we've beat the, uh, whatever the hell you call it, let's get out of here. It oh, wait, the, the door's, oh crap, the door's shut. Uh-oh, we, uh, is there a way out or something? There's gotta be. 
Oh crap, that's locked as well? Oh god! We're locked in! The place is about to blow up! Oh my god, we're gonna die? Like, die, die? Where's the god of it? This is the time for that! Nah, no, I can't count on school for that! <laughs> oh my god, the, the, we're locked in, folks! We can't get out! Oh my god! Quietly! <laughs> Go out in a blaze of glory! <laughs> What are you saying? But... We're locked in! I, I can't believe it, folks, but... That's it! Yeah! He knew what he was doing, just... Didn't expect this. Oh, man... Oh! Bloody hell! Jesus! Whoa! Holy shit! 